Every mile you go, there is a barbecue spot here in San Ignacio and Santa Elena. One of the benefits of what we do is getting to travel across the country as a family. Now we are in San Ignacio and while Orange Walk is known for its tacos, we know San Ignacio for barbecue. So we want to find five different barbecue places and put them to the test and figure out which one is our favorite. Five, the five people that are the best barbecue. Barbecue and House of Tasty. Now that is an interesting combination. We're gonna have to see what that's about. Well, I'm Karina Martinez. This is Boyton's Barbecue and House of Pastries. We do have the best barbecue in Santa Elena and the pastries as well. Oh yes, you can have it with tortilla, with rice and beans. It comes with our homemade sauce and our onion sauce, which people totally love. Yes, I want to invite anyone to come to Boyton's Barbecue because we do have the best barbecue. Okay, the fire heart usually give them more taste than the coal that you want to put the barbecue ones. Top, very tasty. Very full Jazz Brace Avenue. The place named 3 Days Fireheart Place. So a lot of barbecue. Chicken leg, breast, pork, sausage, we do side orders with it, baked beans, coleslaw, flour tortillas, or rice and beans with plantain, coleslaw, or pasta salad, or potato salad. Uh, with Montero's Barbecue, that's my business. I got encouraged via a friend to open a business, and they said barbecue is what's happening in San Ignacio. I've had it over four years now. I'm excited. I love what I do. I enjoy it. It's hard work. <laughs> San Ignacio. Lovely San Ignacio. The Mayan ruins are right here. Walking distance. I'm up the hill, Cayo, though, in San Ignacio. We are hungry and ready to eat. So we got the different places up here. So this is stop number one. Stop number two, stop number three, and we wanted to make sure we had enough, so at stop number three, everything is starting to look like it's closing down, so we got two to make sure we have enough food for everyone to stay full for the night. Let's start stop number one. They're all chicken breasts. At the first place, they have more to offer, but we, we were thinking we were only gonna get chicken and tortillas. We are gonna ask that every place, but then we realized we're gonna need a little more to sustain us. Don't be fooled, they have a whole spread that comes with this, but we only requested the breast and the tortilla to try. Try and get a piece for you, Anya. Then you open, you wanna see how flavorful, how. Mm -hmm. It was good! <laughs> okay, yeah, it not, not dry at all. Really good. Barbecue finger food. Spicy! Mm. I didn't get the spicy, maybe it's in the sauce. No, it's about the well cooked, just like the same. Not not dry at all. Different flavor of sauce for sure. Spicy! 
You can't say that one's better than the other. It's good. It's good. I'd, I'd enjoy either one of these. I do one. You enjoyed that first one? Okay. Um, I'm going to try, we're going to try step number three. And they look like they really cut it open to cook it good. You don't want raw chicken. Especially if you're traveling. Worst thing. Worst thing ever. Bad stomach when traveling. Mm. More of a tomato base for the sauce. You can even see like pieces of tomato on it. Really good flavor. Again, even though it's kind of cut open to cook, Still, it was not dry, flavorful, and uh, really delicious. I'd eat any one of these and enjoy them. Mm -hmm. My favorite was this one because it has more flavor than the others. And my best part is to eat, and none of the rest have this, but this is my favorite part. Oh, you like the skin. <laughs> here, all right, now it's Alexander's turn. Let's get the expert in here. First one. I've had this barbecue before. Definitely different colors. This look a little bit more like a Cory Cory color. Mm. More smoke on this one. Have, did you taste that smoke? Yeah, that's the flavor. Mm -hmm. That's the flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Like you can you can feel the flavor of the smoke on this barbecue. There is a lot of flavor on this barbecue here. Friend, this has real tomato in there. Real tomato. You, you're right, Anya. This has a lot of more. It's more sweet. Like more sweet of a sauce. No, it's, it's not. It's not barbecue sauce. Like he has her own sauce. Homemade, maybe. Yeah, definitely her own homemade sauce because it is not a typical sauce that I ever had before it is delicious they're all delicious it's very hard to choose which one is my favorite out of these three but that is a saying as your tongue they are known for their barbecue it's the capital of the barbecue but tomorrow you're gonna see how much barbecues are happening everywhere for five dollars to eight dollar price it's delicious I hope you enjoyed this video and remember if you want to watch more videos of family adventures here in Belize, stay tuned and you can follow us, Anya, myself, Leah, and Chase. We go on adventures all across the country as we work and do the work that we love doing with the kids. San Ignacio, lovely San Ignacio.